Have you been awed and uh, mesmerized by eloquent speakers? Yeah, talagang magaling magsalita. No? Marami yun. Di ba? Marami yung mga magagaling magsalita. I hope I can be one of them. <laughs> Pero this is what I noticed that great speakers are... Paano nga ba yun? Parang the, the chosen people, the chosen, the chosen prophet, the chosen spokesperson of God, or the chosen messengers of God are not necessarily great speakers. That's why Moses have uh, Aaron. Aaron has, is to be the, the speaker. Meron mas eloquent yata siya kaysa kay Moses. And even, even uh, in the time of... Uh, Basta merong tagapagsalita eh, di ba? Uh, I, I, in the time of Paul, then they found one with Apollos. Apollos nga ba yun? Yeah. Uh, he was also a, a great, uh, uh, an eloquent speaker. So, yung siguro pag sinabing eloquent, talagang uh, magagaling talagang magsalita. No? Mero may mga high polluting word, uh, gumagamit ng mga, especially when they talk about God, mga scatological uh, terms, etc. Well, tipo. But but this is what I also learned and realized that you you don't have to be a great speaker to be used by God. God can use you. Yeah. Marunong ka magsalita o hindi, God can use you. And I, I would remember uh, what what uh, St. Francis would say. Uh, St. Francis says that you preach the gospel, speak if you must. You preach the gospel, speak if you must. What does it mean? You, so you don't have to be eloquent to preach the gospel. And if necessary, then you have to speak. So, ibig sabihin ni St. Ni Francis na you preach the gospel by your kindness and goodness. So, you've got to speak the gospel uh, to your action. And most especially, you've got to preach how you have experienced God how you may be experiencing God or how God is manifesting His presence in your life. Yun ang mangyayari. Ang tawag natin, nung preaching pa rin ba yun o sharing siya? <laughs> uh, natatandaan ko yung isang, I don't know if, it, if you may call that a contest, pero nagkaroon ng, uh, ng, uh, ng anong tawag nyo doon? Parang uh, oratorical uh, Yung, yung kumbaga declamation, yan. And there was, a, there, there was a great one, a great, an eloquent one. And they actually uh, have to recite the same, the same piece. Uh, they would got to recite Psalm 23. So, nauna yung magaling, yung very eloquent. As it recites, the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He restores my soul. My cup overflows. Ang galing. Talagang pagkatapos na pagkatapos niya, tayuan ng lahat ng tao. Standing ovation, pinapalakpakan siya. Ang galing. Grabe, ang galing, galing talaga ng speaker na yon. Parang ganong klase. So, uh, you know, parang kung contest yun, he is sure to win. With, with the way he delivered the Psalm 23. And here comes another one, uh, an ordinary guy, and he has to, to speak about the same Psalm, and Psalm 23 then, siyempre, no? Kaya when he started, he, 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 sp he spoke this way. The, 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 the Lord is my sh 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 shepherd i shall not want and that's how, that's how he did talagang ganun niya pinronounce at at sinabi yung psalm and pagkatapos ng niyang magsalita tahimik ang auditorium yung mga pumalakpak eh walang 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 makakibo and most especially, yung naunang nagsalita, di ba? Oh, hindi siya makakibo. Tapos napansin siya nung bata kasi umiiyak siya. Umiiyak siya. Why are you crying? Why? Parang sabi niya, why, 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 are you, why are you like that? Obviously, you have delivered the sound definitely ten times better than, than this man. Oh yes, I did. Sabi niya, no? I did. I did deliver the psalm, and I did it 
very well. But you know what? Sabi niya doon sa bata. The reason I am crying, because I know the psalm. But that guy knows the shepherd. That guy knows the shepherd. Yeah. Gets nyo? So, yung eloquence natin, maliwala kung yung sa ating pagsasalita galing lang sa nguso, hindi sa puso. Kasi marami tayong ganun eh, di ba? Magagaling, punong-puno ang, ang utak ng, ng galing, pero may problema pala sa puso. <laughs> Iba yung tinutukoy ko, alam nyo na yung ibig kong sabihin, di ba? So, makikita natin yun eh. Marami tayo talagang yun. Uh, parang they do not they do not walk their talk. Yun, doon tayo nagkakaproblema. Yeah. But, but, you know, the eloquence that God is looking for is not the eloquence of the lips, but the eloquence of the heart. And I know you, you have that. Why? Because Jesus lives in you. You know the shepherd. Yes! Yes! Enjoy him. God bless you. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy your day.